The West Indian Day Parade is officially underway. The celebration began at 6 this morning with Juve. The seven hour carnival is the unofficial start to the West Indian American Day Parade. Elijah Westbrook was there as thousands of people lined up near Grand Army Plaza. So it's all about what? The food, the music, the, the culture, culture, everything. The culture, everything. 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 Yeah. Well, this is Juve, you guys out here after 6 o'clock this morning. Tell us what this is all about. Juve is everything for those who don't know. Yeah. It's a chance for us to celebrate our culture. The togetherness, for sure, the togetherness. I don't even know this man. <laughs> Music, dancing, and fashion, and homestyle island food are all a part of the experience. And as the festivities get underway, we're there covering this event, rich with Caribbean culture and heritage. CBS 2's Jennifer Bisram joins us now, live with the excitement this evening. Hey, Jen. What's your name? Lots of excitement. See, people on the parkway here have been coming up to us because they're just so excited to be here. All week, we have been bringing you stories about the West Indian American Day Parade, everything from the history to the costumes. Well, the, the time is finally here. The West Indian American Day Parade is making its way down Eastern Parkway right now. You can see Vincent working the camera right there, just showing you some of the floats. Where we are right now, Eastern Parkway, Utica Avenue. Things kicked off about an hour ago at Rochester Avenue. They'll continue down Eastern Parkway and end at Grand Army Plaza. There will also be performances at the Brooklyn Museum. Now, thousands of spectators are already lined up along the sidewalks, taking in the sights and sounds. Organizers say this is the nation's largest Caribbean cultural festival. Now, we did talk with some people who got here super early to make sure they got a front row seat, and others will be on the float. Take a listen. This is our culture. This is this is what we are. We are a diversity group. We have many different nationalities that we that, that that's a part of our group. And we work with all the communities. We work with the Caribbean, um, Caribbean community. This parade is by Caribbean people for Caribbean people, and it should include Caribbean LGBTQ people. I'd like to be hurly anywhere I'm going. And organizers say over two million people are here every year, and they expect even more people to be here this year. Chris, I got to tell you something. There is a rule of the parkway. If you come here, you have to bring a flag and represent where you're from. This is the Guyana flag. That's what I'm representing here today on the parkway. Of course, we'll be here all day and have much more coverage later on for you. But for now, we are live along the parade route at the West Indian American Day Parade. Jennifer Bisram, CBS 2 News. We'll send it back to you. Jen, you get a good spot there. Okay, sounds good. We'll see you later on today.